What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Cool Cool Kicks. We are back for another video. Getting y'all footage from the state of Ohio. Outskirts of Cleveland. They got a Marshalls. Let's go. This Marshalls opens up at 9.30 a.m. It's 9.36. Let's go find something. Let's go. This is where we start. Okay. Of course, plenty of Cleveland's Browns gear. $12.00. Extra bootleg, team apparel, jersey. Oh man, super bootleg looking. Let's see, what is this, $8. Bunch of Browns t-shirts, but not much else, $12. These are all Nike dry fit, so not too shabby. Like different looks, which is kind of cool too. These are all larges though. So you got medium, this is a Nike dry fit as well. Dog pound gear, normally 35 for all these, go for 12. Was hoping for some fire browns jerseys, not happening. Oh wait, look, right here. Oh man, a bunch of Mayfield stuff, different aisle. Beckham Jr. jerseys, these are the, these are like bootleg on-field jerseys, or like the low-end ones, super, super thin, normally $80. And uh, where's the Ross tag? There's the Ross tag, 20 bucks. Mayfield jersey, these are the same bootleg looking ones, 15 bucks. NFL, oh no, this ain't even Nike, this is NFL players, players association ones. A bunch of Baker Mayfield and, and those Beckham Juniors. This one's a stitched in one. This one's a, 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 the Nike stitched in jersey. But it is of Mayfield though. Normally, is it an authentic? An authentic one? Holy cow, 325 for 20 bucks? Wow. Size medium, these are normally 160. This is actually fire if it was a decent player. Okay, so these are the authentic ones. Does have, does have the elastic along the arms right there. Obviously everything stitched in. This is actually super nice. It's just Baker Mayfield. These were normally 300 down to 20 bucks. That is insane. Then more dry fit shirts. $15, $12, not bad, especially since they're normally like 35 usually. Nike dry fits, not too bad. Then they got these bootleg ones. They got the authentic ones right there. And then bootleg ones, more expensive. More expensive, that's hilarious. They got a ton of the Beckhams, as well as the Mayfields in double, triple XL. No shorts though. I was hoping for some calf shorts, brown shorts, nothing. Checking out the men's shoes. It's gonna be slim, man. It's gonna be Virginia extra slim today, I think. Tired of showing these. Got so many of these at all times. 35 for not the checks. Harachis going for way too much. $60 for some Harachis. Got the classic boots. Been seeing these at a few spots. $60 for these. It's only a size 7 though. That's it, man. That's it. What did I show you? Like two pairs. Checking the slides as well. Nothing. Nothing. Store number two Marshalls. Right outside of Canton. Hope you guys enjoyed the Hall of Fame video. The Hall of Fame store video. All right, let's go. Men's active. And apparently we see a theme. Pretty much the same as the Rams gear out in LA. To see a bunch of brown stuff. But it is with all the players that are gone. The t-shirts are 15. Right. Landry's gone, right? 20 bucks for the Landry ones. And then even in the regular section, see all kinds of brown stuff. This is like, like this is like a really nice one too. Look, stitched in letters and everything. But it is Baker Mayfield. Baker Mayfield. So what? Normally 160 down to 20 bucks. Damn! Can we see any other teams? Like in Florida, we saw all kinds of different teams out here. We just see Cleveland gear, like this T-shirt for 15. But that's it. No other teams. Can we get like one other team? One of the player, not just Beckham Jr. 
and Mayfield. No Mitchell and S. Love in the short section as well. Wait, I missed this. Detroit Tigers. Long sleeve. And this is actually pretty nice. Nike Dry Fit Normal 8035. That is a large. Nike Swim. 54 to 20. Why do you need a shirt when you're swimming? All right, we do have a sneaker section. It hasn't been very good at Marshalls, though. But we're going to still check. Got some Reeboks that nobody's really looking for. Got them for... Got them for $40. Got some Pumas nobody's looking for. Got some NMDs. Okay, these are size 5, though. But do got NMDs. These bad boys going for $40. Okay. RSXs, $40 for these bad boys. All right, nothing to show you guys. Slides, also nothing to show you guys. Might have to buy luggage before I go home. Don't really know the luggage situation yet. I might just, I might just buy a box. I'm, I'm trying to see if we actually need luggage at home so I can replace that, good time to replace it. Or like I said, I can just get a box, um, go to Home Depot, pay $4 for a box and then have that shipped. So I did pay for a checked baggage. I think it was like $60, $62 or $61 for Spirit. This is the biggest it can get. This is the biggest it could be. I think it's a total of 60 inches. This is 59 if you add up all the dimensions. Um, so I can get one that big. That's, that's actually pretty big. Like, yeah, all my stuff will definitely fit in there. All right, Ross, store number three. Back in the Cleveland area. Our active top over here. Bengals Nike shirt going for 15. Puma BVB, is that like a soccer team? I don't know, but $30. Team Apparel, $20. Adams ain't even with the Packers anymore. So tired of seeing those. Okay, got a track jacket, 25 bucks Adidas. Good materials on those. And then a Browns medium t-shirt. It's a Nike dry fit. There's two of them right here, $40 down to 15. Ohio State long sleeve, $30. 35 to $30. I've never seen such a small disparity in price like that. Usually the price is half or under retail. That's interesting. All right, let's go see what's up with the sneakers. Did get hella lucky at the last Ross I did go to, but that was Pittsburgh Tech. Bengals Nike shirt going for 15. Puma BVB is that like a soccer team? I don't know, but $30. Team Apparel $20. Adams ain't even with the Packers anymore. So tired of seeing those. Okay, got a track jacket, 25 bucks Adidas. Good materials on those. And then a Browns medium t-shirt. It's a Nike dry fit. There's two of them right here, $40 down to 15. Ohio State long sleeve, $30. 35 to $30. I've never seen such a small disparity in price like that. Usually the price is half or under retail. That's interesting. All right, let's go see what's up with the sneakers. Did get hella lucky at the last Ross I did go to, but that was Pittsburgh Tech. Some baby Kyrie Infinities going for 60. Y'all like Minecraft backpacks. Or your kids like Minecraft backpacks. $11, that's pretty good. Got some Ultra Boost right here. Just one though. Where's the other one? Where's the other one? 25 bucks. Jamal Mashburn discount store. Regular right here, 25 bucks. Dang it, that was pretty worthless. <laughs> I was gonna say one ultra boost, not even a pair, just one single ultra boost. I'm trying to find some for a couple people. No slides either. Women's section, why is the women's section so low? What's going on here? Got some SFS boots. These are men's size, I don't know why they're here. $60 for those. Some Under Armour, these are men's as well. And did you guys see that? Did I show that on camera? The What's called the alarm started going off right when I put it down. $40. Got Hoka's. 
These are the Challenger ATRs. These are definitely men's sizes. Got there a lot of men's sizes here. These are going for 80. And then do got these bad boys ATRs as well. All right, so so far the Pittsburgh Ross was better. The Pittsburgh Nike outlet was better. Um, dang, everything in Pittsburgh has been better so far than Ohio in terms of sneakers. Everything else I can't talk about. Um, all right, let's go. Got a Burlington right next door. All right, maybe not right next door. Same parking lot though, but I did drive because it's a big parking lot. Let's go. Then of course we are in Cleveland. So yeah, a bunch of Cleveland here. <laughs> the same Baker Mayfield stuff. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is fire. Oh, that is dope. This is a double XL though. Has that really fluffy. Oh my goodness, that is fire. Maybe if I find a better size, maybe? Yeah, for 17, I'll grab that for somebody. But all this stuff, yeah, they don't want. They don't want. Dude, this is nice too. Team apparel. This is an XL. $20. Is that an R34? Dang, if this was like a media, my kid would like this shirt. He's like all into cars. Dang it. $7 too. Do you got these? These are pretty low budget though. $20 for Team Apparel. It's actually not bad. But if you do get the cheaper stuff, like the inside ends up wearing out and gets all over your t-shirt, um, 20 bucks for those. They got like the good Baker Mayfield ones. They got the bootleg ones. This is the bootleg Team Apparel one. This one's going for 15. They just got a generic Browns jersey. It has a Browns logo on it. NFL Team Apparel, pretty low budget at 20 bucks. All the good medium brown stuff, it is gone. Nike Dry Fit for 13. Uh, they got a Bucks, pretty low budget Bucks, uh, like a practice jersey looking tank top thingy. I don't know, who cares? No NBA jerseys, no nut, just just a bunch of Baker Mayfield stuff. God dang it! Can I just find like some Cavs shorts? You know, that's all I want. All I want, you know. Don't have to be Mitchell and S. I'll take some Nikes or something, but something? Nope. Just another Baker Mayfield jersey. That's it. That's it. All right. Check out sneakers. I think this might be the last last stop out in uh, Cleveland. The huge sizes, of course, whether you're in L.A., whether you're in Minneapolis, whether you're anywhere, pretty much Trey Young 2s. Always going to see them. 40 bucks. And ones, we've been seeing these, $20. Bolts, Pegasus, 30, was it, 39s? $40 for these, if they were smaller, maybe. Zigtex, whatever the heck these are called, $30 for those. Reeboks, more of these, $40. And more, and more. Grant Hills in a weird colorway. Don't see these too often, 35 for these. And then Hardens. Got these hardens right here, yellow hardens. These are a size six, way small. These normally go, what, 35 bucks, something like that? I don't see a price tag on it. University of Kentucky, these are the off-court slides. Off-court Nike slides. These have been going for 10 bucks. These don't even have a holder. And they look used. Got some huge, I mean huge. These are huge. Yeah, they're huge, man, 40 bucks. Those are the D rows, 1.5s. Pittsburgh, what are these, the Pegasus 39s. These are size eight. These are what, 40 bucks, yep. Colt size eight. Cleveland Brown size six, 15 bucks. Uh, more size six, another one, if I put, found some bigger ones maybe. The Colt seven, that's it, man. Wait, 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 we got Seahawks. Size 12. Then we got some Jets ones right here. Size 11. Those are all 15 for the off-court slides. Kansas City size 9. 15 bucks. Hmm. Did find these off-court slides size 9. Did find these. 15 bucks. I think I know someone who might want these. Um, it's the same family that I'm buying all the jerseys for. Bought a Kelsey jersey as well as a Mahomes jersey for him. The, the triple XL ones. And look at these T Max. Why are these so far away from home? Seven and a half go for $35. J. 
check in the backpack section and there hasn't been much of a selection in backpack because back to school so everybody's picking them up those happen to be right there all right still in ohio i thought that last store was going to be the last stop i did make it to this ross in youngstown i think youngstown is where tony hinchcliffe grew up all right let's go all right i hope this video isn't getting too long but i already see a bunch of dope stuff or one dope thing got the georgetown iverson jersey this is normally 100 bucks 135 is down to 30 dollars do i need it do i not need it that's a good question that is a large i don't know i like to fit mediums um this is a kyler murray jersey that's for 40 dollars and of course browns merch tons of browns merch of course baker mayfield jerseys and then another kyler murray right, let's see what they got size in the mediums soccer jersey Guadalajara, these are down to 25. A couple of those, and then another Guadalajara jersey for $10. This one's 10 bucks. Wow. Of course, another Baker Mayfield jersey. Project Rock t shirt going for $13. Okay. Damn, now there's an Iverson jersey. This is a medium. Damn, I'm gonna have to get it. Ohio State shirt. Is that Justin Fields? 30 down to $13. Bengals hoodie. It's a budget one. Team apparel. Another Kyler Murray jersey. Three Kyler Murray jerseys. And then two Georgetown jerseys. Damn, dude. 75 Baker Mayfield jerseys that nobody wants. <gasps> you got a Jalen Hurts. This is a small. Wow. Wow, man. 150 normally, down to 40 bucks. Triple XL, another Jalen Hurts, another Kyler Murray jersey, double XL as well. Then some, some of these bootleg. Yeah, these are bootleg. Another Guadalajara jersey, but no shorts, no Mitchell and S Love in the shorts section. Dang. Are checking out the sneakers now. Got all kinds of Hoka Challenger ATRs. All eight and a half, it looks like. Some of these Adidas going for $25, smaller size. Got some RBX that look like Hoka's. Going for 20. Got some more Hoka's. These are more Challenger ATRs. I haven't seen this colorway though. Size 11 and a half. Ooh, that's the first time I've ever seen these. These are huge though, size 14. Pegasus Turbo Next Natures. Of course, we've seen this cheaper at some of the outlets, kind of just depending if you could find a refurb or something, but 50 bucks for those. Of course, been checking the slide section, nothing. Almost skipped right past these. 10 and a half, you got the Infinities, Chiron Infinities, $55 though. Did find these, of course, slide size nine. Did find these, 15 bucks. I think I know someone who might want these. Um, it's the same family that I'm buying all the jerseys for. Bought a Kelsey jersey as well as a Mahomes jersey for him. The, the triple XL ones. And look at these T-Max. Why are these so far away from home? Seven and a half, go for $35. Almost missed this last one, size seven. Got some Dame Sixes. Dame Six, Pento Advisory. These sevens. These Dame 7s? I think they're Dame 7s, my bad. Yeah, Dame 7s, the parental advisory ones. 25 bucks for those, that's a size 7. Checking the women's section. Not much at all, yo, not in the women's at least. Do got some Ultra Boost PBs, personal best, size, what's that, 7 women's, 25 bucks. Then someone placed these Kyrie's right here in the wrong section. But that is primarily it. Man, but did grab these. Did grab these. These are freaking fire. Not the hugest fan of, you know, all that splatter paint or whatever, but for $30, hell yeah, yeah, I'll take them. I am a fan of Iverson. Georgetown colorway is dope as well. Let's go. Time for breakfast, 6.30 a.m., which is what, 3 a.m. LA, LA time, which is kind of crazy. Ooh, they 
got oh, they got some good stuff. Let's go. Damn, I haven't had freshly made waffles in forever. Let's go. Let's go. Let's eat banana bread or malted banana. Yo, let's go. It's the best breakfast I've had in a long time. I normally don't even eat breakfast, to be honest. But yeah, I gotta be out of here by 7.30 a.m. I need to hit a bunch of stores as soon as possible. Headed to Cleveland today. Headed to Cleveland. Let's go. Nice little scene right here. Tons of restaurants, barbecue spots. Oh, this is hilarious, okay. Okay, the dopest comedy club here. Got Dave Smith. Oh, there you go. Then I came here for something specific. Got a ton of Cleveland souvenirs here. Whenever I go anywhere, my kid always wants a magnet. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Got some magnets. I have to pick one out. I guess this one. This isn't the dopest looking, but not that much of a selection. And I got other spots to hit up, so, all right. And it was dumping, it was like raining like crazy while I was driving here. It's like 85 degrees now, it's like 85 degrees. Look at this, man, we're stopped because it's a bunch of ducks. Or geese, geese? Crossing the street, man, what the hell? What the hell? Yeah, we definitely don't get this in California. What's it in Alaska? I do remember this in Alaska. But all of them fools is going, damn dog. Or damn ducks.